Hello YouTube and welcome to Destination Lego and welcome to another unboxing, build and review video. So today as we can see I am going to be unboxing, building and reviewing the buildable brick box 2x2. Two two. So this is set 40118, it's for ages 7 plus, comes with a piece count of 203 pieces. Currently retails here in the UK for £12.99, that's from the Lego store or the Lego store online. And it retails in the United States for $16.99. Okay, so first off I just want to uh, give you a look at the box. There's the rear of the box, we just saw the front of the box. But one thing on this is actually a thick box. I don't know why yet until I get into it. It only has 203 pieces. Um, in there, but yeah, as you can see, if I put a minifigure in front of it, oh, you can see there, there's the scale anyway, scale of minifigure on there, but just to put my sig fig in the front, there yeah, you can kind of see just how wide um, this box is. Put it around that way, give you an idea there. So it's quite a large box, so I'm interested to see. Um, what and how um, is inside it? That's pretty much a view of the complete box. So, okay, so let's get the box opened up. Um, we have two pieces of tape holding this particular box together. Let's cut those there and there. So, let's take a look and see what we have got inside. What is taking up all that room? We obviously have a number of uh, plates by the of bags, set of instructions. Okay, so it is all crammed in there actually, so it looks like there's quite a few big pieces um, in this set that might explain it. So if we can see in there, there's one bag there and there's quite a few large plates. Again, we've got some um, quite a few. I mean, that's a, pretty much a bag full of uh, one by two, four, six, eight, ten, one by twelves, one by twelve bricks. Um, and again, in that one actually looks the same. One by twelve bricks. Yeah, and more bricks in there, smaller pieces there. So we have one, two, three, four, five bags, two separate plates. Uh, the instruction manual. Just a very quick view of the instruction manual, which is all folded up. So there's the front, inventory piece count on the rear, and 43 pages of build. Okay, so obviously none of the bags are numbered, so let's get these bags all opened up, and I'm entering them out on the table. Okay, so then we can see all the pieces on the table. So like I said, quite a few of the larger pieces, uh, the 1x12 bricks, quite a few of these plates, 4x12 plates. Um, yeah, many, not that many small pieces, I guess. Um, so that explains the size of the box. So anyway, let's get this set built. Okay, there we go. Hopefully you did enjoy that build in super quick time. Um, so there we can see the two um, boxes in front of us now. So let's take a look at the red one first. OK, 
Okay, so here is the red box all complete. You can see on the top we have these um, round 4x4 four four bricks. Obviously four of those on top. We have our little handle here. I'll show you that in a second. Just take a spin round. You can see there are Technic pieces used in this one. There's the rear of the box, so that's going to be the hinge mechanism in there. Back round to that side. And there's the underside of the box. Okay, and back around there, that lever is obviously to open the box, so we just simply lift it up on its hinge there. And there we can see inside the box, and it uses these um, tiles. I forgot the name then. <laughs> tiles, sorry. Um, there's the spare pieces which I've put inside the box that come with the set. So a few spare pieces. You actually get a spare bucket handle and a spare paintbrush, which is pretty cool. Then a couple of other miscellaneous wall pieces. Away. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Pretty cool little um, buildable, buildable brick storage box. Um, be good for kids. Obviously, they can you know put things in there, store them away, hide them even. Give them hide this box. It's not huge. Um, but yeah, great for kids, you know, and for adults, you could store things in there as well. I'm sure I'll find some use for this um, and the other one. So anyway, let's take a look at the black box. Okay, so on with the black box, same or similar design on the top. If we take a look around this one, um, hopefully you can pick up there. There is the little handle on this one. I'll show you that in a second because this is a different designed box. Um, it's not the same as the other one. Um, obviously big difference on this one is it comes with this minifigure and obviously his little um, paint bucket there. And he's holding his paintbrush and as you can see he's painting the black box green. Um, I'll show you that minifigure in a second. So as you would have seen no hinges on this box so the way this one opens if I just take that this one is actually a drawer. So we can pull this one out and it does stop. There is a little mechanism in there to stop it from actually coming out. So if I tip that up, there is actually some bricks in there. I'll explain what they are in a second. Um, but similar sort of design, a bit smaller inside this one. We've got obviously some tiles at the bottom of this one as well. Um, nice and smooth. Obviously on some tile runners inside it too. Um, similar design underneath. Um, but yeah, you can obviously, again, if I take those spare pieces, Good little storage place. You could even use this for storing pair spare pieces, but there's multiple uses and multiple things you could obviously um, put inside these buildable brick boxes. So, what are these pieces for? So it does come with these. These aren't spare pieces. So we have a one by four brick. We have two of those one by four bricks, and we have a one by four plate. So quite simply, they are so if you want to. You can take out the green bricks there and also um, the uh, plate here, which the minifigure is on. Remove him, then you can just have a complete black box, obviously similar to the red box about the minifigure on this. So that's all they simply are, just to replace those pieces in there. I'm not going to do that. I quite like the little fun feature of having the minifigure on the side of it, so I'm going to keep mine there. And I will keep the pieces, the bricks, Inside there, um, the green little stud obviously just falls out of that bucket. So let's take the minifigure off. Obviously basic minifigure. Let's take a closer look at him. Actually there you can see him. Standard minifigure comes with his overalls there and you can see that paintbrush um, and obviously the red baseball cap single sided face. So that is the minifigure. Okay, so there we go. That's my uh, sorry, my review complete. Hopefully, you did enjoy the review and indeed the um, unboxing and build too. Uh, my opinion on these, I think they are cool little boxes actually. And like I said, for kids, I think they'd be um, great fun. Um, and I'm sure the older kids, teenagers, and even adults like myself can find use for these for storing little pieces in them. But mainly, I would suggest aimed at. Um, some of the younger kids I mean it is for ages 7 plus so I know that Ethan my 6 year old will love these so I might get him a set of these because um, he obviously has lots of little knickknacks etc which I'm sure he'll love to hide away in these anyway guys if you did enjoy this please give it that big thumbs up let me know what you think to these little boxes and if you'll be getting them down in the comments 
section along with any other comments, questions, feedback that you may wish to leave down there. And if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel, Destination Lego. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers!